So we're on the Fuji X-T2 with the 7 Artisan 7.5 millimeter fisheye. I can't suggest this camera setup enough. I paid like $500 for this camera used on eBay and this is a video beast. Like if you're doing vlogs, if you're doing skateboarding content, like the, the fisheye, the 7 Artisan 7.5 millimeter is probably the best I've ever used. And it's cheap. It's like $100 on eBay. So. I can't suggest this setup enough. So not only is this my current video setup, but this is a setup that I can actually really push and really suggest you get. So I got the X-T2 with the grip for like $500 used on eBay. This microphone's $100. Uh, this is probably like 11, this little flippy screen. And this is a great setup for any type of vlogs or videos like that. I might do a test just walking around with it. I'm sure it's not the most stable for like standing, but if you're like talking headshots, if you do skateboarding or anything like that, this is a great setup for photo and video. What's up guys? I'm testing out the Fuji X-T2 with the microphone and I've got a little flippy screen on top of it so I can see myself, but I have to be kind of like bent down about to here to see myself. Uh, it's a little bit dim in the bright sunny day to be able to see what's going on on that little flippy screen on top But yeah, I'm just testing this out with the audio and everything. It's kind of windy. We've got the seven artisans 7.5 millimeter f 2.8 at 5.6 on there So I wanted to do a talking head type shot because this is where this setup is going to struggle There's no stabilization. So if you're just walking around with the camera and lens this is where you're gonna struggle with a setup like this. But I don't think it's gonna be that bad because it's such a wide lens. So let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. Is this usable, especially if I was just standing here talking to the camera, you know, if I wasn't walking around, it'd probably be pretty good. So here's just standing, here's walking around. So let me know in the comment section, did this work? I'm also at, Let's see, about 0.5 of a foot. I, I probably should have adjusted the uh, autofocus first before I started doing this video, but I thought I had it right. But everything's kind of moved a little bit since, since I uh, had the camera in my bag and everything. What's up guys, today I'm going to be comparing the Fuji X100V to the X-T2. So just as far as size goes, without the battery grip, they're pretty comparable. I've got a grip on both of these right now, but they're basically the same height and width without the grip except that little viewfinder on top. So. The good thing about the X100V is how small the lens is. You're not gonna be able to get a lens as good and as small for an interchangeable lens system. You can get that 27, but the 27 is not as good as this 23. This 23 F2 is much better than the 23 F2 that you can get for the interchangeable Fuji X mount system. This is my video setup right now. I've got a little flippy screen where I can see the screen. I've got a fisheye lens and a microphone for just vlogging make skateboarding videos how-to videos on skateboarding stuff and this is my photo setup i use this and i use the gr3x for photography so yeah that's some of the differences and the comparison in the size uh yeah i don't care about the optical viewfinder i actually think the xt2 with this eye cup has a much better viewfinder in my opinion I know this is a more high-tech viewfinder, but it's just harder to see in bright conditions because you have to really press your eye up against it. This one, you've got this nice eye cup, and it's a bigger hole, you know, to put your eye up to. So I would skip the X100V and get an X-T2. 
a small lens and just shoot with that. It's a great deal, great for video. I like the X-T2 better for video. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this kind of content, scroll through my channel, check out my other videos and hit that subscribe button. I've got a Ricoh versus Fuji videos coming soon. So thanks for watching.